the drought situation is going from bad to worse due to the global climate change, resulting in four consecutive failed rainy seasons since 2020. Furthermore, the World Meteorological Organization has predicted that the fifth rainy season is likely to fail. This is a life-threatening prediction for the pastoral communities and their livelihood. The number of people in need of humanitarian assistance is currently at 500,000. This translates to half of Mandera County population. Therefore, I appeal to His Excellency, the President of the Republic of Kenya, President William Ruto, to declare the drought a national disaster. As county government, we are already working on an emergency response through water trackening and food aid for the vulnerable households in conjunction with the National Drought Management Authority and donors. We are currently, we currently supply 1.8 liters of water to 192 villages daily. The drought is approaching its is peak in mid-October and will require up to 4 million liters of water daily to save the people and the livestock over the next 30 days. Therefore, we need at least 75 million that is Kenya shilling 75 million for the for water trucking, fuel subsidy, bore repairs and maintenance. It will also allow us to set up a rapid response team to fix borehole breakdowns and facilitate emergency response. Currently about eight 1,000, 80,000 households who are receiving cash transfers from various donors and, and National Drought Management Authority, and this, however, does not cover all the vulnerable families. An estimated 22,000 additional households need cash transfer for the next three months. To protect these families from the adverse effect of climate change, we need an extra 1.2 billion shillings. Despite our concerted efforts, Mandera is still experiencing an acute water shortage, food insecurity, malnutrition, limited pastures, and reduced livestock prices. Moreover, the high demand for livestock feeds with 50 kg of cereals going for between Kenya shillings 4,500 to 5,000 has pushed for has pushed food prices higher.